fellow learners and well-met adventurers. This is a video which I feel like I have to make because the channel wasn't always called Gaming Treasure Chest. It did used to be called Lan Up. And back in the Lan Up days, like it started with me and a friend and then evolved into me playing card games, mostly Legends of Runeterra. And unfortunately, I just fell out of love with the game and uh, with creating so much content, it did end up just burning me out. I'm gonna be honest, I burnt out and um, stopped uploading. And that is what happened. So it's been two or three years now. I do feel like I need to make this, like a, to let people know the transition. I know there's gonna be people who are gonna be unhappy with it. I know I'm probably gonna get a, lot, a mass exodus of people leaving. But I just wanted to say, if you do watch this video and you were supporting back in the day, thank you so much for the support. I know that like, a, if you wanna to continue to support, I'd love it. But if not, I completely understand. So do not worry, I just wanted to say thank you for that time. But we are now obviously transitioning into Gaming Treasure Chest, which is all about 3D printing and Dungeons and Dragons. It's also about making a 3D printing business. So let's see what the hell I've got going on at the moment. And so I can look back and track and see, oh, look at old foolish Gomez, where he used to be and where he is now. So let's see what I have. Welcome to the laboratory. Yes, this is where, I do apologize for the poor lighting, by the way, and also for the shaky cam as I'm currently holding this up. But this is the nerve center of the 3D printing bit that I've currently got going on at the moment. As you can see here, here are two Neptune 2s which are doing most of the work. I wonder what the hell that is printing. Oh, who knows? Maybe we'll find out in a later video. Or perhaps people can guess what the hell it is. But anyway, <laughs> if you do, put it in the comments below. I'd love to hear what people guess. So those are the two main forefronts of what's going on in this 3D printing business, which I'm currently trying to set up and start. We also do have a Neptune 3 over here, like the Elgu. Um, haven't got that going yet just because um, it have, has been having some problems so we'll sort those out but then that'll be the third one going. But yes, we also have this bad boy as well, the old Tur laser cutter. Oh, have a good little look at all the laser cutter which has been going on in there. Mostly from my wedding was the last time that this was used when I got married to my lovely wife. Also, side note, my wife is probably going to hate me for doing this video and doing this recording about tidying up and whatnot up here. She's probably going to have a massive go but she's married me now. It's too late for her. She's locked in. But yes, that's that is the laser cut which I'm hoping to get involved in the business as well. At the moment I'm currently obviously concentrating more on the 3D printing side of things but there are some things that I do want to do with that laser cut hopefully very soon. And if people want to see um, that stuff as well I'd love to put that up because obviously the whole creative process of making things for the website and making things for people um, to enjoy and, and whatnot, especially like a D&D community and just like tabletops and gaming in general, uh, that is the plan. But um, yeah, you have seen the laboratory now. Let me know what you think down below or let me know what you think is printing down there. And I'd, I'd love to hear what you think. So as I said, I feel like this is a video which I had to make to explain the transition. I just want to thank everyone. I said like, if you are still watching this, thank you if you did support in the past. And if you do continue to support, I would love that and like I love us to build a little community again because it was such a lovely thing to have but I said I understand 100% of you are leaving this is not your thing it's not your bag baby I understand but they said just thank you so much and I hope that you enjoyed this video and uh, yeah let's uh, get in on this new adventure and hope it leads us to great heights and good times and laughs and ha-cha-chas anyway thank you so much goodbye